Hey Foxes, I'm Jay. And I'm Haley, and welcome back to RFTV. In school news, Hartsville High School will be hosting another blood drive November 22nd, 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. in the arena. The blood drive is only for Hartsville High School and staff, so be sure to sign up today in room 115. Are you interested in attending the Naval Academy? JROCT will host a visit from Midshipman First Class Patrick Morgan this Tuesday from 11.40 a.m. to 1 p.m. If you're thinking about attending the Academy and have questions, please visit room 206. To begin today's episode, Riley and Giselle are here with our two students of the week. Hey, Foxes, I'm Riley. And I'm Giselle. We're here with this week's student of the week. Hey, what grade are you in? Andrew Edwards, I'm in 11th grade. Were you expecting to be student of the week? No. Why? Because I was already student of the week. Myself. Why do you think you got student of the week? Well, I guess somebody saw my positive energy. What's your name and what grade are you in? My name is Emily Taylor and I'm in 10th grade. Were you expecting to be student of the week? Why or why not? Um, honestly, I wasn't. I didn't, I'm a quiet kid. I don't really, I'm not popular. So. <laughs> why do you think you got student of the week? I guess because I'm in the IB program and people like, that's, I'm in the IB program, that's really it. Thanks guys, congratulations. Now back to the anchors. Thanks girls, and congratulations to our students of the week. JD and Grant are here with updates on HHS wrestling. Okay, uh, I'm here with Sarah Moody, a uh, new wrestler. I'm going to ask you some questions. Uh, what's your favorite part about wrestling? Um, my favorite part about wrestling is the one-on-one -on -one aspect, just being me and that person on the mat. I love that. Oh yeah, what's your research part about wrestling? Um, the bruises on my knees and like the cuts I get, that's all. <laughs> uh, how's the new girls team come together? Um, I like it a lot. It already feels like we're a family. The whole team, too. Uh, well, thank you, sir. You're welcome. I'm here with you to talk about wrestling. What's your favorite part about wrestling? My favorite part about wrestling is probably how tough it is. It's a fight. It's who can get hit harder and come back. I, I like how tough it is, this competition. What's your least favorite part? Probably cutting weight. Um, like not being able to eat. How do you think y'all are going to do this year? I think we have a solid team coming back. We're ranked fifth in the preseason uh, state ranking, the 4A. A couple state qualifiers, state champion coming back, so I'm pretty confident. Now back to our anchors. Thanks, guys. That was really insightful. Sarah is back with another funny segment this week. Let's see what she came up with to make us laugh. I'm here with Jaquez and Cam, and they're going to try to make each other laugh. Ah, Simone's like, ah, no time, you know? Ah, we get on, ah, right away? Wow, what's that? Ah, drag <laughs> piss time. Ah, like those. Ah! <laughs> Oh, oh, no. <laughs> 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 ah, literally poking, you know? Hey, my thighs. Uh, uh, right? Yeah, you know, a little bit in class, you know? Oh, hey, oh, ah, no, oh, got you. You scared me there. Oh, oh, ah, got you. Oh, careful. Sorry. Can't keep that, baby, you know? <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. Keep this hard. Hey, we'll do it. We'll do it. Ah. Knock knock. Who's there? The man with the plan. Uh, who's the man with the plan? Ah, the Terminator. Oh God. Ha! What did say to Dr. Doofy Smurf? Oh yeah. Ha! Got your parry. <laughs> what did the cow do to the grass in Kelly Town? Eat it, I guess. Laws versus West Florence. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to expose you guys. Sorry. Run. Come back here. Come, come, come back here. Come back. 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 Come Corniest dude in school right now. So. Uh, back to the anchors. Yeah, I'll do it. Thanks, Sarah. Campbell and Alala are covering the history of Thanksgiving. Feast your eyes on this segment. Hey, Foxes. I'm Alala. And I'm Campbell. And today we have some Thanksgiving history for y'all. The event that Americans commonly call the first Thanksgiving was celebrated by the pilgrims after their first harvest in the New World in October 1621. This feast lasted three days and was attended by 90 Wamapogue Native Americans people and 53 pilgrims. 
The first ever Thanksgiving was celebrated in 1621 over a three-day harvest festival. Turkey wasn't on the menu at the first ever Thanksgiving. Abraham Lincoln proclaimed Thanksgiving a national holiday on October 3, 1863. Colonists in New England and Canada regularly observe Thanksgiving days of prayer for such blessings as safe journeys, military victories, or abundant harvest. Americans model their holiday on a 1621 harvest fest shared between English colonists and the Wampanoags. The most important Thanksgiving tradition is a big meal with family or friends. Some specific dishes you can have are macaroni and cheese, cranberry relish, and of course pumpkin pie. Many Americans attend a local Thanksgiving Day parade, and these parades are often televised. To celebrate the expansion of its Herald Square Superstore, Macy's announced its first big Christmas parade two weeks before Thanksgiving in 1924 promising magnificent floats, bands, and animal circus. A huge success, Macy's trimmed the parade route from six miles to two miles and signed a TV contract with NBC to broadcast the now famous Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. President Roosevelt was concerned that the Thanksgiving should be celebrated a week earlier. Thanksgiving, as it was known, was decried by Thanksgiving traditionalist and political rivals and was only adopted by 23 of the 48 states. Congress officially moved Thanksgiving back to the fourth Thursday of November in 1941, where it has remained ever since. That's all we have for today, Foxes. Thanks. Now back to the anchors. Well, that's all we have for you this week, Foxes. Stay Foxy, Hartsville High.